hello everybody welcome back to my channel this is london city on the right side you can see the short building which is the tallest building in europe and um, straight ahead you can see the tower bridge and this is thames river on the left side you can see the skyline of london on the extreme left you can see st paul's cathedral so this is um, Tower Bridge, which everybody calls London Bridge, but it's actually Tower Bridge. And yeah, this is Thames River, and this is typical London weather. It's cloudy. You can see the Tower Bridge very really clearly from here. And on the left side is the Tower of London, where they have all the jewels. This is St. Paul's Cathedral. It's the most iconic building in London. Very old, but very beautiful building. So I'm now walking on the Millennial Bridge and over the River Thames and this is the view of the other bridges including the Tower Bridge in the background and the Shard Building and the view is spectacular so this is the skyline of the York City there's a lot of construction and noise in the background they're building new buildings this is the panorama of St. Paul's Cathedral. Lots of people are walking on this bridge. I've never been on this bridge before. So this is the other side of the river. There's a modern museum right there. The River Thames is very quiet right now, it's low tide, but the short building really sticks out, it stands out. Yeah, you'll get a lot of construction noise in the background. So yeah, this is the Millennial Bridge from one side of the river to the other side. It's a nice way of crossing over, there's no traffic, it's a pedestrian bridge. very nice and quiet to walk over the bridge and this is the view from both sides of the bridge there are a lot of old buildings next door to the new construction the modern buildings so it's a mix and match of everything and I believe there is an office of MI6 not far from here at the Parliament building. Yeah, I keep showing you the Tower Bridge because it's a beautiful bridge. If you walk on it, you don't get this view, but I will one of these days. It's one of the boats you can take for sightseeing. passengers and I see more boats this is even bigger lots of tourists in town it's a nice way to do sightseeing in London boat which um, actually manages the traffic in the river this boat is called the city cruises I just want to show you the Millennial Bridge I just walked over from St. Paul's Cathedral to the other side of the river I decided 
decided to walk down the river. I've never done this before, but I'll be touching the Thames River water just for fun. And you can see when there is high tide, the water reaches all the way up here. So that would be a dangerous time. You see all the green, that's where that's high the water high tide can come to. So yeah, I am actually walking towards the Thames River for the first time ever. Yeah, this is Thames River. This, this is the closest you can come to. It's actually very, very, very dirty water. And this goes all the way to the sea. It's a very long river going right through London. Yeah, these are the waves of River Thames at the backdrop of the St. Paul's Cathedral and the Millennial Bridge and the Shard Building. thing I have to mention is the sand in the river is so beautiful and soft while you go to the beaches in England they're full of rocks so this is so soft and beautiful sand it's unbelievable it's like this is end of beach. part one in London please it's like share and subscribe my channel and look out for more London sites I'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye. There are some rocks over there, but this is all powder sand.